Who's the better scorer in their prime, KD or Melo? Damn. <laughs> that's an easy fucking answer to me. Score, that's just overall. The getting of buckets. I mean, you would. Levels, like you probably said. Me- probably overall, you would go Melo because he had four level, five level scoring, which is layups. Like everyone c- talks about three level scoring, right? That's, that's basic fucking people. Triple threat. Right? Casuals right? as. as There's casuals, ball. you know, layup, midi. And then uh, the three-point line, it's three levels. Motherfucker that's posting up, and there's ISOs, yep. right? And, you know, uh, Melo posted up, and Melo was uh, a, a, a um, ISO player, right? That's five levels of, you know, scoring. You know, that's what I said, that basic bullshit is, you know, oh, layup, and he got the mid-range, and then he has, you know, you have a guy that's great at posting up and a, great, a guy that's great at, you know, um, one-on-one isolation. So when it comes to the... Uh, who is the most, you know, um, complete score? And you would say Melo for me. Same over here. Y'all you know, agreed like, on something? Yeah. Hell wow. yeah. Hell wow. yeah. I mean, because we're looking at it from the lens of tier level scoring, right? And I seen Melo from when he had the growth spurt and he had the handle. And a lot of people get away from Melo's handle where he can bring it up and bop, 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 hit you with the midi, hit you with the off the dribble. Right then, Melo is playing small forward, so he can come off pick and rolls. Right, so when you're looking at that compared to KD, I say give Melo seven foot height, and you're like, okay, what are we doing here? But KD has that seven. Foot. I understand that, so that's an advantage for KD. But I'm just scoring whatever, whatever. So skill set, you say, all right, Melo six eight in the post. You know what I'm saying? Face up, you talk about ISO, you talk about off the dribble, you're talking about shooting a three. Everything is just as effective as KD. Mr. B, I, I don't know. I see. I don't feel like you're rolling, Mr. He got to prove it, though. He can't, just, he can't just say KD and not show me. No, I mean. Show me. It's being shown. No, it's not. It's still being shown. Show me. It's build, that it's still better being than, That it's better than Melo's. Walk, no, no. That, that, walk okay. into the league. I, I, I mean, listen. I'm he's the best. Like, I'm, he's I'm, the best. I'm, I'm, see, the problem with mine is... KD? Like, <laughs> what, KD, what KD does and how he does it is himself... We'll never see it again. Right? Like, he's going to go arguably like one of the top sco- natural scores to do it. Right? But this is coming from two different places. Like James Harden, right? James Harden will go down as a great scorer, but I'm judging off of the levels of how can he can score. He can only score one way, right? Harden can only score the way he does it. He can't pin down. He can't come off screens. He can't do any of that. But how he perfected his scoring, top notch. Same thing with Kevin Durant. How he perfected his scoring is top notch. But he don't post up. And he don't, he don't. He come off pin down. So tell so me, so down, tell no, no. me what, tell me what, tell me, what, tell me his skill set. Like, tell me his skill set. I just told you Melo. I just told you Melo. Put that bitch in the rim. Put that bitch in the rim. Put that bitch in the rim. Like that's what I'm saying. Tell me. Break it down. Wherever. Break it down. Wherever. Wherever. Every time I step up between the lines, I'm putting that bitch in the rim. How about that? That's just what it is. No, 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 no. I don't give a fuck. Wherever, when I step. What's this? This is the court. Hey, I'm when put, you said he put it lines, in. Her. Is it a? When is I it step a, between the lines? Is it that a, bitch is going in the rim. Is it a mismatch? Yes. For whoever. Why is it a mismatch? For whoever. He's he's seven foot and seven. Foot. Say it again. Seven foot. Say it again. Say it again. We'll never see it again. We'll never see it. We'll never see it again. We'll never see it, we'll we'll never see it again. So tell me if his put, skill set Mello, outside of Melo. If we put if we put weight on uh, Kevin Durant. Good luck. This Good luck for everybody. That's like saying, give me, give, give yeah. Melo seven foot. No, but Man. I love, like, listen, give Melo, give listen, Carmelo listen, seven uh, foot. Years old at Syracuse? Are you fucking no, 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 but, serious? That was, but this is, this is, that but this is a conversation that that's deeper than just who's scoring, right? I wanted to do this, and it, it'll hurt a lot of players, you know, careers. If you say, all right, name all your all life uh, uh, top 10, five level scores. Right? Because it's five levels of scoring, real five levels, that elite five levels. That takes out generations of players. Because, yes. you know, when you talk about the 80s, you're really talking about Jordan, the 80, 90s Jordan, then you got Bird. Yeah. Right? Maybe it. Bird. I mean, the big man, we, gonna, we can't, the reason the big man is not a part of this because there's 
Right. But you're talking about, you know, those two, um, Kobe. But I guess what you're talking hey, about. Hey, you know hey, what I mean? Paul you got a, um, Paul Pierce. Paul Pierce. Right? Um, oh, Paul, Paul Pierce is a T, you know, does T Mac it? a little bit. T Mac is four or five. Does T Mac post up much? A little bit, but not much. Yeah, I mean, you know, T Mac. But that's what I'm saying. You see how when you add the other two elements of posting up and ISO ball, you can see how a lot of great scores will be out of this category. And that's the difference. Like, Melo is in a category, KD ain't in a category yet because of the posting up and all that. So you I mean, he tries it, but that's not his skill set. His skill set is face up and I'm just gonna shoot over you. Yo, can we look up the stats? Hold on, my bad. Like yo, dirt? Yo, can we look up the stats of when Carmelo played against LeBron one-on-one -on -one and when KD played against LeBron one-on-one? -on -one? Yeah, uh, KD's gonna bust us. But Melo's gonna bust. But Melo... I, I, I just want to see the numbers. I just, the one-on-one -on -one matchup. I know they got it. Oh, I'm seven, no, no, foot, no. I'm seven foot playing against but the 6'8 no, 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 guy, no, 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 man. man. What that mean? What but that mean? What that mean? I'm little. I'm skinnier than you. I like... What do you think about Chris Middleton's game? I like Chris Middleton's game. It's, you know, it's gets it the, is. It's straight to the What are you talking about shooting and scoring and skill? Yeah, right? Know. Give him seven foot. Nah, that's different. You comparing Chris Middleton to Kevin? No, I, I just said give Chris Middleton seven oh. foot. Who, oh, is, who is, is he? No, are you comparing to Who Chris is he? You're, you're comparing just Chris Middleton to Kevin. Give Mikael Bridges seven now, foot. Who is he? You're, comparing you're talking about natural, but you're talking about like one's just a phenomenal <laughs> natural score, right? KD's just like, he's just a natural. Like, he's going to go, he goes down as probably one of the best scores. He compared Chris Middleton to Kevin. Yeah, I didn't compare about, anything. I said, if you give him seven foot, who is he? You're talking Himself. about five low score. Do you throw free throws in there too? No. That's six it's level. scoring. That's six level. I'm just talking about like. It's the sixth level of scoring. I'm just talking about somebody who can post up, right? Yeah. He's dangerous in a post up. He's dangerous in the ISO. Dangerous getting to the basket. Dangerous on a pull up. Dangerous for the three, right? That's how you evaluate. There's, that's what I said. There's a different level of scoring. Just everybody's just used to the basic. Yeah. Mad so you, you want to talk head-to-head -head Carmelo LeBron, but what do you want to see? Because we got we got the or the matchup between Melo and KD. But we got I the mean, we got the LeBron Carmelo comparisons, bro. Yeah. Melo in the post. How many times they play against each other? Melo in the post hey. is unstoppable, bro. You have to foul Melo in the post, bro. He's a bully. Just, I'm just asking. He's a bully, them. bro. It's I mean, different. They, that's the because difference. Because we love talking about numbers. They played so. against each other 46 times. LeBron won 30 of those. Melo won 16. Yeah. Uh, I just want the, yeah, the regular season. Uh, they played 36 times. LeBron won 22. Motherfucker, say the number. The, 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 the number. We don't care about the record. Because it don't matter. The record, the record don't, don't fucking matter. matter. Uh, so, uh, <laughs> point comparison, LeBron averaged 26.2. Melo averaged 21.3. Game highs, LeBron had 43. Melo had 42. See, but that makes sense. See, how Melo plays, LeBron can defend that. LeBron can't defend KD. Because there's the height difference. Can't none no. of them defend KD. No, no, no. Because there's the height difference. LeBron, LeBron Neither can't, one can defend KD. The the LeBron, no, no. They can't, they can't defend KD because KD's guard-like. So Melo's going to try to toughen up. He's going to try to do this with yeah, LeBron. No, LeBron right. can guard that. KD ain't doing all that. KD going to sit in there and yank. But KD, KD, KD can't do that. KD can't do that. All Mel, all he has to do is sit there, turn around, steppy. Nah, yeah. You can't play bully right, ball. That's not his advantage. So KD, exactly. KD, right. LeBron comparisons. KD, twenty nine point eight points per game. LeBron, twenty nine point six. But what's the mellow KD comparison? That's the they question. Ooh. Did they play much against each other? Yeah. I mean, yeah, they own the West. Yeah. They own the West. It just, it just, yeah. That's what I said. It's, yeah, it's, but I don't know if they were guarding each other like that. But that's why I'm even looking at these numbers. There's so much other shit you got to factor into it. Like height? Guarding? Like I don't know. I just feel like what changed me with KD is when they played against LeBron in Miami, and they went back and forth. When I saw that little one-on-one, -on -one, when they had that little... They went, even, like, even, they went up even, and down. Even like, with Golden State, but it's just this. It's just, like whew. LeBron can guard Melo easier because where Melo's going to try to play that game at, Braun is strong yeah. enough to handle yeah. that. And as the chess KD, point KD's out. On a, KD's sitting there with this, yeah. and it makes Braun move left or right, and when he pulls up, it, it just call, it's, it's more energy to guard KD. It's not diminishing KD at all because it turns into T-Mac if he's 6'8". That's a lot of energy it to turn guard into KD. Me, uh, it turns into T-Mac if he's 6'8". So what I'm saying What's is... What's wrong with that? Nothing, nothing. That's why I said. Oh. There's no diminishing <sighs> him being 7 foot, but when we say, wait, wait, damn, wait. that was a tough shot, well, it's because he getting that bitch off because he's 7 wait, foot. Wait, T, 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 uh, healthy T-Mac... Uh, um, Melo ain't better than a healthy T-Mac. I, I listen. Wait, what? Listen. Melo better scored than a healthy T-Mac? Uh -huh. Primes? T-Mac was all five. Listen, I'm you not... You see, he was shimmying Kobe and... Ah! 
<laughs> I got the same shit and, you got. And then you see what he came back down. But Duke KD got that? Duke KD got that? But what I'm saying, but I'm saying, what I'm saying is that he's trying to, but it's the same, he got the same thing, though. That's what I'm saying. But Duke KD so, got the Mello, T-Mac. Mello ain't. I think Mello would beat up T Mac because he because Mello yeah, 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 I'm saying, that's why. But, but he's not a better scorer than T Mac. But that's why I'm saying I don't think T Mac. But T Mac score a lot. T Mac did easy. That's easy. No, I mean, game. I mean, oh, that's easy. Oh my, I was there when I he mean, scored sixty. That wasn't even a good game. I got a lot. He of, missed. Got, the man missed like nine, ten free throws. Missed a bunch. Of, he should have had eighty. T Mac better than uh, James Harden. Yeah, as a score. That, that, James Harden perfected something. So, that, like, what's the what, what, the travel? No, what I'm saying is James, James Harden perfected what he does best. Like, if you say, James Harden, I'm going to take the ball out of your hand, be efficient in scoring, can he do that? All I got to do is come up and do a step back and score every time. But that's time. what I'm saying. It's a, it's, I it's a different. Do it's a different. It's a different thing because he only has, like, if we're talking about complete scoring, right? James Harden can only do the one. That's like if we said, that's like when everyone talks about Giannis. He can only Euro dunk. He perfected that. Okay. Right? We can't take it away okay. from him. Okay. Right? We can't All take right. it away from him. Okay. He, perf- he perfected the fuck out of that. And if you can't stop it, he shouldn't have to do nothing else. But you okay. can't put him over okay. someone else just because he got something that you can't I stop. can't, like when, when, when people say, yeah, who are you going to take as a scorer? And then I always say complete scoring because I, I, I like to say if you can take the ball out of my hand, I can, they can do something else and be effective. Right. Right, I'm gonna go with someone else, but if there's a nah, just getting buckets, I want James. <laughs> I, I, I'll take that. Because you, you can't, can't stop. Because if you can't, you can't stop, stop it. that, then you I you don't it. need to do nothing else. Right, right. T-Mac a better score than Paul Pierce? What? Yeah. Hmm. Paul Pierce could score from every. No, 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 no. Paul just, was a scorer. Yeah, because that's a good question. Because it, it, it just looked different. It looked different. I feel like it just looked different. That's why I say with the KD thing, it looked different because you're seven foot. Paul Pierce was in the NBA in the fourth quarter. There was nobody better than him for like three years. That's what I'm you saying. ain't on this show. <laughs> <laughs> but, but, this is what, but, but you know what I'm saying? But this is what I'm saying. This is what I'm asking. Like, I'm, I, mean, I, mean, I mean, but you asking me, I mean, like, I'm, I'm not a Penny Hardaway fan and I'm not a T Mac fan. Nah. They didn't do nothing for me. So I'm just looking. Yeah. 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 I'm watching both be great. I studied both of them too. T-Mac was, was different. But Paul, it was so I, I easy. Like, like Paul just looked different. It was so like it was so e- it was so easy for Mac that it was like it was like Vince Carter, right? Yes. Vin, it was just easy. Like I, I like I'm so mad at Vince for what he did mm. to the game. The goat debate. What should have been him? Hundred percent. Okay. He was so naturally gifted than anything you've ever seen. Period. He had everything. There was no like he had everything. He dribble, shoot, fade, moves, footwork. Like, he everything. had everything. If he had this the mindset like Kobe, like I'm better than everyone, and I'm gonna show y'all each. There was nobody who was stopping that man. Right. There was nothing that was stopping Vince Carter. When Vince Carter came in the lane, there was no big man that was willing to challenge it because they didn't want to be on ESPN. Excuse me. That, that, was, that was him. Think about, go, show Toronto. Every time he went back to Toronto, show those stats. Because he didn't like them, they traded. Watch what he did to them every single time. He averaged damn near four. So you think the trade is what, was, what stopped his uh, hungriness? I just think he was, he was just too nice. It was fun for him. It was too nice. It was fun. It was. It was. He was just nice. See, I don't like players like that. He was That's why I said, like, when, like you know when, who else was like that? Who else was like that when we played against him? And not. not I'm just saying he was not. Like he was just a nice person. It was like Jamel Nelson. Like he Jamil wouldn't want to like like crack jokes. Yeah, like nice not, not that he was like. I'm just saying like he was just like. He didn't take it serious. Like, like, he he was just like you know trying to crack jokes because he felt like you know maybe I'll bust his ass or whatever. But I'm just looking at him like the team that you own. And y'all fighting for the finals, like I wouldn't be fucking like you know cracking jokes or or anything like that. Like, yeah. like so I get it. Like it's just like some players just be 
going like, through it. Like, it's too cool. And it's like, hey, what's up, man? How you doing? Like, fuck out of here. Like, you know? Like, <laughs> like yeah. you were doing that? Did you didn't say hi back to him? Not really. I mean, not really. Yeah, I mean, I mean, but, I mean, I was a rookie, so like, I would just be like, yeah, like, all right, whatever, like, hot. But it's just like, nigga, I'm trying to I'm trying to kill like, you. Nice, y'all know but, but, one. No, like, no. Some people know? like he had other person yeah. personalities on yeah. the team where he just was chill. Yeah. Right. He was just he was just chill. He was cool. Like, um, but like, vent. Like, I mean, I seen it. And I'm like, oh, you could have had fifty tonight, bro. You bullshitting out there.